I think the most exciting thing for me about the Through the Roof project is the fact that we're going to end up with a very stable environment for the paintings in the picture gallery, which is so important to the National Trust and also culturally to uh, British art collection history. There's loads I'm looking forward to about this project. I'm really looking forward to getting volunteers really involved, giving tours, finding out more information and really just engaging visitors with it. I think it's probably about the damage and how much damage just even a little bit of water seeping in can do to about all these beautiful paintings that are in here. So I think just explaining to them what damage it causes and why we need to protect them. Many of our visitors often say they'd love to see some of the pictures. So for example, the picture of the child up there. Well, we're going to be able to take those paintings down and focus on them so you have a chance to see them more closely. And some of them are going away for conservation, so they'll come back looking especially nice and clean. And I think it'd be great for people to see them up close when we're doing it. Um, I'm not actually sure what I'm looking forward to most. I'm quite excited by a lot of things. It's all the interest that's going to be caused when we're going to show people up on the roof what's going on and actually seeing how they're going to do it. I like that part of it. Eventually when the scaffolding goes up, experts are going to be able to get up to the roof at a level they haven't been at before to see in detail how it was constructed. And also once the 70s roof comes off, there'll be more opportunity to see the roof as it was. For me it's the technical detail and what's happening. And I guess probably when they take the old roof off, what they find, you know with builders when you get a, a building, they say this, this and this, and when they take it off they find more work that needs to be done. So that sort of thing is quite exciting for me. It's the oldest existing example of using iron to support a roof and give light to a picture gallery. And it's important because it was reproduced when Nash extended Buckingham Palace later in the century. What's really vital about this roofing project is that the picture gallery at Attingham is one of the great galleries, not just in this country, but in Europe. And when it's finished, you'll be able to come into the gallery and really sense that you might actually be standing in a great Roman palace in the middle of Shropshire. It's very exciting. I hope that you'll be coming to see what we're doing at Attingham and see the project happening and come every single step of the way with us. It's not just about the roof, it's also about the decorative surfaces. Yes. I'd love to tell the visitors and help them understand the complexities of this roofing project. It's absolutely immense. It will be at least a couple of years. One time you'll be able to visit the picture gallery. The next time you may see there's a crane on the front lawn. The next time when you look out of a window from our top floor, you'll be able to see the progression of the project. So each time a visitor comes, they'll have a different experience.